Sorry about that. Hearthstone crashed. Um, hopefully we don't lose the game because of it. A whole bunch of all my windows actually uh, just randomly shut down, which was a bit odd. But we're here. Just need to load up the chat again as well. So hopefully we get past the Hearthstone loading screen in time to not lose. Um, usually one of my settings on Hearthstone makes me click something, but okay. So we're reconnecting. I think we're going to be in a bad position. We've been unactive for a bit of time now. Right, it's us. Uh, we're about to die. Um, two damage to everything. We'll not do what we want. I think we drop the Twilight Guardian again and hope. So, so clearly something happened here. Like another abusive sergeant happened. That God, that bronze beat is getting so much value. It's like I shouldn't have. Let it stay on the board. I should have played the Holy Nova. It's too good. But this should be quite a good Holy Nova now. Um, so, I need to Holy Nova here. Then I can hold in over again next turn. Hopefully survive and get some card value going. Awesome. Play into my hands. Sea Giant, please do not play in my hands. Um, so I need to remove that Sea Giant pretty quickly. Uh, how quickly? Um, let's find out. So, okay. So I've got seven mana to spend. I can go up to 12, Holy Nova go up to 14, take 8, go down to 6, and he has 3 cards in hand. So, 1, 2, the question is, is this more than this? And that's just true. So, we have to do, we actually just have to do that. It's a shame we're one mana off, because we could have been in a much stronger position um, next turn. He has two abusive sergeants and a defender of Argus. And his brand's gone. So it's like he's lacking. He should be lacking a little bit of gas, but I'm like, he could be running two power overwhelming. This even he's running one power overwhelming. It's like, we're still in a bad position. It's like, let's not beat around the bush here. Um, we are. Yeah, we are in a bad position no matter how you look at this. Okay, cool. So we need to, we need to do this. It's like, this card just kills us out, right? And then we have five mana left to affect our life and the board. So we need to heal to go up to eight to survive being hit by both of those. So the only thing we can play is the Blackwing Technician. So it seems like playing... Like, if he goes to the face... Um... <laughs> We're really fighting. Like, if he goes for the face, we have to bang into one of them that we can kill, which is kind of both of them in the end. Heal ourselves to go to four. Yeah, so we just lose here, I think. Oh, that's good. Um, so let's make this the wall to end all walls. Okay, we need to just buff you the fuck out because you're what's going to keep me alive. So, Q 
hit into you to, to drop the amount of damage. And hopefully, you know, if we're lucky, the 410 will do some work, brings back into this game. Hellfire. Oh, it's bullshit. Hellfire, Hellfire. Oh, God. Then he plays Dreadsteed. How did he let him play Dreadsteed? Alright. I feel like game is a bit bullshit. Like, it doesn't seem fair. But. Oh, okay, cool. There's a corrupted map. I just noticed. Alright. So we activate a three drop that we can drop on turn two. Hopefully, we get something a little bit smaller. Which is no. But we've got a, you know, other than turn one at the moment, three, we've got to, got to play. None of the things that usually break, break. Oh, this is like a really bad one. Corrupted Griffin. So I usually don't like playing the North Shear Cleric on turn one because it doesn't g like justify that it's going to generate value. But it's a mage. They're going to be too stupid to ping it. It might just die to a Frostbolt. So I'd rather just pass. Okay, so scientist, I'm cool with that. Um, just gonna be careful with what he gets. So, seeing it's a mage, this will deal with the mirror entity. Well, like that will deal with the mirror entity as well. Uh, yeah, I reckon we coin this out and get him to try and damage it. So it's a fail, like he pinged that and then went to there. Why would you do that? That seems odd. Alright, so I'm just gonna bang you into you. Use you to draw a card. If you're a mirror entity, you're a mirror entity. Yep, heal. Alright, so we don't know what your secret is, but it's not a mirror entity, which is good. It could be a counter spell, which we have the villains chosen to take that out. If we need to pass through a removal spell or a holy nova, um, I think we're in a kind of okay position. Now he's going for the base. I'm not sure what's going on there. Um, all right, so it might be something that destroys my creature as it attacks. So I'm going to heal this first and blast you into you. Could be a vaporize. I'm like, who the hell wants vaporize? But ice barrier. Okay, cool, no problem. So we're playing against freeze mage. Which I hope it's freeze mage. So we could bump out doomsayers and stuff. So let's just pass. Oh cool, there's an eye under the... You click it, it goes red. Oh, that's pretty funny. Okay, so there's another secret. Let's attack in. Check that it's not a vaporize. Is it another ice barrier? Okay, so the two ice barriers are now out of the deck. We can all be happy about that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine cards. If we heal, we go to ten cards. Which is not the greatest. Um, so we can't 
go to three. I think we bump you out so we can bump you out next turn. And then not push more creatures onto the board than we have to. I'm just going to end turn. Frost Nova, Doom, so yeah, New Zealand, that was going to happen. Okay, so, is there anything I can do here? And the answer is just, no. Could have 10 mana and kill out the Doom, so, but I'm just going to, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, if I heal, and to draw a card, it's not in my best interest to do that. So I'm just going to heal myself. Another secret, okay, which means I need to play around. Actually, but if it's Freeze Mage and what does it do when I poke the eye? Does the eye get angry or does it just do the same action again? Do you get angry when I hit you? Alright, so let's check some shit out. Um, so I'm going to open with the cultist. Close the cultist, I'm cool with that. Now I'm going to... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... I need to start making room for the Chromagus player, so I'm going to drop the Twilight Drake. There's 70 cards in deck. Okay. So... Secret. Attacking onto you in case it's going to destroy my creature. It's not. Uh, play the Chromagus. Plus 10. So, hopefully, this makes him burn a fireball or something. Because we've got the tech to get rid of a, an ant Antoninus. If we don't draw an actual removal spell to get rid of one card. Emperor Thracian. Okay. That's bullshit. Um, what's that card cycle out? Blackrock. Okay. Yeah, I think it's in standard. Oh, it could be a duplicate. Fuck. If it's a duplicate, this is really bad. But I'm going to hit my Chromagas into it. It's not a duplicate. Thank God. Okay. So that's at five. I'm gonna put a Velen's Chosen on it to take it out of fireball range. Um one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, you just seem good in this matchup, so I just wanna pass you out. Hopefully, get him to like use a flame strike or like a f like it, get rid of another doomsayer. Four, five, six, seven, eight. I just want to always draw the two cards from the Chromagus if I can to just grind that value over him. So, because the game's going to go long, and I want to make sure that I'm in a position where I win that game. Like I've got more cards. Blizzard into Doomsayer. No, he's pinging it. So he's hopefully got... I think he's got a fireball next turn or something. That's super... That's super odd. Okay. So... Healing the Chromagus takes it out of fireball range. But he could have two cards. Alright, what are we going to do here? So, I know the play is to, to heal this guy. To make him use more cards if I can. Um, how much do I heal this guy by? 
He's got some control decks, so he probably uses Polymorph, so I don't want to use another Valence Chosen on it. Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So I'm going to play you, hit to face, and play you. The reason why I didn't play these ones is because he can actually see that I would have two of them in my hand. So that makes him think I've only got one, if he's, if he's actually watching that. Okay. Flame strike, sweet, ping. So, I didn't go the way he wanted, I guess. Um, okay, cool. So, we've, got, we've drawn two Sarahs. That's really, like, where we want the game to be now. So, I'm going to... Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 again. Man, life's tough. Bang, bang. I need to heal you up and... Valens, Valens you now to get you out of range. Um, so I don't want you hitting a thing. I want to keep you completely away from there. Um, so you bang you and you bang you. I'm okay with it being at two because it still needs to use a card or kill it to, you know, or get quite lucky. You can ping fireball, which I'm kind of okay with because I've got the two Yuseras now. So I think I'm kind of ahead enough. If he doesn't kill it and I draw like Holy Nova, I'm pretty, pretty excited by that. I think he's going for the luck kill. That worked out well for him. It worked out very well. I've got one shot to draw a Holy Nova here, I feel, before things get a bit a bit bad for me. Okay, cool. So I can bang you into you. And heal you. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Play a whelp. Um, just, just one. There's no point playing two. I'm like, I'm happy playing two cards. When he eventually deals with the the advantage that Chromagus is getting me, I just drop a Ysera. Like, I don't need cards right now. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I'm eleven. I'm eleven cards to his. I uh, like five. Um. Well, I think it was six actually. Sweet, so we finally dealt with the Ysera. Which is when you. Sorry, finally dealt with the Chromagus, which is exactly when you drop a Ysera. Yeah, because I know it's not a count spell, so I just dropped a Ysera. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I don't need to drop anything else. Like, the Ysera itself is going to like continue to generate value. Laughing Sister, cool, another threat. Doesn't deal with Antonidas in the way, but we've got an answer to Antonidas now. It'd be nice to get, like, multiple Holy Novas to deal with. Uh, well, Holy Nova doesn't do much in this matchup. Alex Straza, okay, cool, we've got an answer to Alex Straza in our hand. Um, we can also tech it, um, which puts you down to four. I can heal you up to six, but I really want to be healing me now. Yeah, I keep you two in my hand. I'll just do that. Heal me, I think, is important. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and hit for four. Again, I'm happy with going to the late game. Also, fatigue doesn't. Like, Ice Block doesn't help with fatigue. Okay, cool. Here's his one chance to enter Nidus us. Fireball into Fireball. So that was in his hand since the Thoracian. Oh, it's so annoying. Oh, I didn't take into account you. Fuck. Okay, cool. Um, 
So let's do it. Uh, Vol'jin, and let's holy nova into the Vol'jin so the Acera doesn't die. And we also heal up, which is part of our game plan. So, which doesn't let him answer the uh, Acera. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Cool, we're good. We got two Emerald Drakes now. We can drop those, but um, how far are we in the deck? Nine, nine. I don't think we need to. He's got another Doomsayer. Like, if he Doomsayers and we can't get rid of it, which is the current state of affairs, uh, we'll probably... He's got double Firewall. Fuck, that is annoying. Oh, it's so frustrating. It's okay. It's no fun getting salty. guy that would be good to know um, no 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 do we want a two drop I think we want to fight for something that gets activated we've got none of those all uh, right so you passed me so you don't have a one drop um, I think we try and power out the 3 4 Dark Colors. It might not get its value, but I don't give a fuck. This just seems bad against, like, yeah, I, like, but he's not going to do that. He's going to Frostbolt it or do nothing. And it just seems there's no reason for it to be out. Like, it eats a Frostbolt, but it can, it can generate far more value. And if I'm like behind with card advantage and I um Chromagus. Like it's good. Oh okay, this is the best shadow word pain ever. Um if, if <laughs> imagine if it hits like a Ysera or something, that'll be so good. Uh Twilight Guardian. It's kind of annoying because the battle card doesn't trigger, but fuck I can't do anything about that. Okay. So a lot of time, it's like the way I see the North Shark Clerics is that kind of like two card swing, where it says, um, I drop it, I heal. That's the user card to remove it. So it deals more damage. That's three, five. Can't get the extra damage in. Okay, just go for faith. And uh, heal me, I guess. And past it. Okay. It's not a mirror entity, so I'm just going to heal myself up. Pass down. That Alexstrasza fucking was bullshit last game. Like, I know it wasn't bullshit because it was like, you know, why wouldn't you be playing Alexstrasza if you were that deck? But like, it just won the game. Like, it, by itself, it won the game. Mm hmm. So, I think we power word shield here to keep this thing kind of relevant in the game. So, let's power word. Chromagus, sweet, okay. I hate it when you draw Chromagus from a power word, because it's just easier to get it to combo with power word than it is um, these clerics. So, I could cycle one, but I don't. Want to? 
Okay, so it's a 2 6 at the moment. And if it was last turn, like I could have Vol'jin Bang, but I think this is slightly better. I'll trigger the secret, hopefully. No. Okay, so we don't know what the secret is, which is kind of quite odd. Okay, he's got two secrets now, so this is getting scary. Okay, so I'm going to heal. Heal Vol'jin, switch him to a 2 2, which is okay. But that is better of as an answer to Alex or someone. Um, I'm just going to heal you up. So you need to ping to kill this. Drop a 4 4. It's annoying. <laughs> turn after I could have. Okay, so that's what I thought you would do. Okay, cool. We gotta be careful with Cromagus if he's running the Oracle. Oh, shit, son. It's Wayne Brady. Okay, fuck you. Oh, it could be a counter spell. Fuck. Fuck it. Let's do it. If it's a counter spell, it's a counter spell. It's a duplicate, it's a duplicate. So what car gets duplicated? Duplicate. Yeah, but what got duplicated? Duplicate. The water element got duplicated. Okay, cool. Like, luckily it's not the cold light. So there any, any more cards, man. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We're going to drop you. Clearly you're not the deck I thought you were. I've played a spell. I've played creatures. A creature's died. I haven't targeted yet, so it could be a spell breaker. Because Spellbreaker can be a total blowout. Okay. So you have two of those fuckers on the board. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Four, five, six, seven. I reckon I just go for Facey. He's low enough. And if it's a nice block, it's a, it's a nice block. But... He needs to deal with the Cro-Magus, otherwise he's in a lot of trouble. So I'm just going to drop stuff. He might wipe the board or something, I don't really mind if he does that. <sighs> Flame Strike. Yep, I'm cool with that. You're going to ping into that, or are you going you're gonna to try and kill my Cro-Magus? Yep, okay, you wipe the board. But, a whole bunch of things have been killed. That's good. I think we're in a good position here. Okay, so, I'm worried what it means if it's a Valence Chosen. If it's a Valence Chosen, we're like in a, we have a huge problem. Uh, like if it's a Spellbreaker. But, we have no way to interact if, if it's like otherwise. Um, so let's, we have to do it, like, it's like, if you're not interacting, I feel like we're just going to get, we're going to lose this game. Alright, cool, so it's not a Spellbreaker, thank God. Um, I think we can cycle them, looking for a removal spell, and then if we don't get one, uh, he'll, he'll, he'll trade in with one of the clerics. Chill more. Uh, Twilight Guardian. Uh, well, pass. I'm okay playing the Whelp to put more pressure on the board, because, um, I can just play Chill more next turn, and just continue to, to represent that pressure.
So what do we do here? I'm going to kill this. Yeah, let's just kill that and heal. Like, it puts him kind of back to where he was, but... Let's see what happens. I mean, we could be losing, and we don't know yet, but... It's low enough. But we're moving to a point where it's like... <laughs> Anything left that that can be is an ice block, so things might start getting slow. If we get a fireball on a 3-2, that's that's good. Kind of happy with that. Um, I'm not so happy with the fact that he's played that card. 1, 2, 3, so... Three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. We can get him down to low life. Like, he has to trade into things. So he can't not trade into things, so I think we're fairly, like, safe. Um, we can also kill it. Which seems good. I, mean, I guess we heal to just get the card advantage back up. So that's really, really useful. Like, that, that, that's a... I can test. Like, if he wipes the board, I can put the pressure on next turn. So he's attempting to wipe the board. So he might ping Frostbolt. I could see that happening. Um, Alright, let's kill the ice block. Who thunk it? We could heal you. Which... Let's us get blown out by flame strike. He's already used one. But he's gone through a lot of his... More than half his deck. Playing you... Doesn't let us get blown out by flame strike. Don't mind if we get blown out by flame strike. He could play another ice block. But he could do that anyway. If he plays another ice block, we're giving him more outs. But we'll close the game one turn later. I'm going to go for the thing, something thing that closes the game a little earlier. So he can't flame strike and. Well, he flame strike Frostbolt, he needs. So. He needs more cards. Reno! Oh, you son of a bitch. Copy Reno, okay. Okay, Reno. <sighs> okay. So, I want to keep that for something more threatening in his deck. Reno is not a win condition, Reno is just an annoying part of the deck. Uh, so, let's heal you up, make you a little bit more sexy, and then just bang through. Do want something else? Like, I don't want to get blown out by things, so let's just keep passing. So, if I go into there, Reno into a thing. So, Reno in it. Oh, okay. Why would you play the sludge punch? Wouldn't you want me to hit the Reno? Okay, I'm gonna put you on you because you uh, make you harder to kill. Bang you up to five. Um, <laughs> drop a taunter, why not? Because that puts the Reno into that. Or a spell gets burnt. Do I play you, or do I play you? I think I do I play anything. I think the board's fine. I have one card left in my deck. Okay, I'm losing this game. 
I can't deal with the the Reno tech. Fuck, Reno is good. It looked bad, like, when it was first released, because you lost a lot of consistency for it. Your hero can only take one damage a time. Son of a bitch. Um, okay, let's let's start banging things up. Let's start healing ourselves up, because we have no choice. We're not winning this. Let's just concede. So you and you are good together. You're not good because I need I have the Azure Drake for you, but I think I can get something before I need to play you. So let's go. This hand is got a lot better. So if I don't draw a dragon, I miss my like four drop world, but but this matchup's unfavorable if it's the Murloc fucking thing. Two. Or do I go two? I want to play you instead. Um. Three, two. So do I play you with the coin, or do we wait a turn and play three five and have a bigger body? Um. I'm just gonna play you. Okay, and I can now just play the heal game. I've got no other play anyway, so that worked out well. So it doesn't seem to have any Murlocs then. I could be wrong. I'm wrong a lot. kill you, but I cannot kill you. I can use this as an excuse to get value. You go down to six, then you go to five. Or well, I can heal you and you don't die. So, that seems like a better play. So I'm going to bang you into you, play you the cleric, heal you back up to four, draw a card. So I may have just cycled the cleric, but I've just got a kill card for that. Which, if it turns it into a Ysera or a Chromagus, we are going well. You... Oh, it doesn't kill it anymore. <laughs> it sucks balls. Um, zero, six, eight. So I play my 3-6 wall. 3-6 wall dies to it. But it buys a turn to draw something else, which would take it down to five health, which I can then take down to two. And Holy Nova. So I think I play you, because Holy Nova does let me kill you. Three, four, five. I didn't attack. Ah! If I lose and he's on like one life, I'm like, I'm like so annoyed. Okay, so that makes that play not actually work anymore. Uh huh.
think I need to hit him, like, because if I hit that, it just bangs into there, and I lose value. I'm like, that's not a good play in general, but it's like... This is Thracian. Fucking hell. I don't know what this deck is, but it's been really fucking annoying to play against. I know, but I'm just fun. Like, I'm really... For the first time ever, I watched Shadow Word um, Death. I really do. This needs to hit something of worth. Oh, fuck. Oh, this game is not going well. Three five three five. So, I guess the only chance I have is to power watch you and start looking for a shadow word. Death didn't get it. It's just a bit too far behind there. Dragon. Oh, hand is awesome. If, like, we had an awesome hand last game, but fucking bullshit happened. Um, well, it's not bullshit. Death Guard's a good card. Like, we just didn't. Let's the issue with Doom Guard. It's like, this what's going to be good about it not being a standard. A card that it's like, you inevitably mull to not kill. Isn't going to be a thing anymore. We got one, two, three, four. That's pretty good. One, two, three, four, five. That's pretty good. But, uh. I'm gonna drop you and go for face because. That's why he can't just attack in and ping. But also, that it allows me to drop one more card without having to worry about playing around a mirror entity. Even though that's the thing I would put into a mirror entity. So maybe that was a misplay. So he's got no secrets in hand. But now he's got a secret in play. Which is good to know. Uh, and it might be a counter spell. So I'm going to coin to make sure it's not a counter spell, and then Villain's Chosen. Okay, so we didn't play any creatures that turn, so it could be the uh, mirror entity. It could be. It's not duplicate either. We know it's not duplicate. Okay, cool. Um, here we are again. So four five makes it problematically not useful. So I just want to keep you alive and get value out of you. Because if you go down to one, it's like it's effectively you don't exist anymore anyway. Lothar, dickhead. 
uh, uh, I don't have a way of dealing with that that is effective. What I can do is attempt to draw a card and remove it with a spell. You, you got a mirror entity. Alright, we played well around that. Um, so, let's not heal. Let's bang you into you, because that's the correct play there. Uh, so you don't draw a card. Heal, so I do draw a card. And then pass turn with my 4-4 four, four, and my 1-3. So will probably be the last game before I go to sleep. By the way, if for some reason you do watch me play, if you do, I feel sorry for you. Okay, so I've got a 1-3 on the board. Oh, I've got choices here. Uh -huh. It could be another, another thing. Okay, well I think I... Oh, I could have... Yeah, that would have been good. I think we need to drop you to perhaps burn the, the mirror entity if it is one. Nope, sweet. And we can just straight out kill the worm. It's a duplicate, we don't mind. Okay, so it's not a duplicate. Which is good. Could be a counter spell. Okay. Let's just... Let's just add some pressure to the board. Do I play you? We just used a flame strike. May as well. Might like he we he played a mirror entity already, so he might be running two. He played a what you call it? <laughs> Deal one damage. Great. Oh, actually, that's good here. Um. So this seems good. If it is a counter spell, which I feel it might be, nailed it. This still triggers. This doesn't trigger. That is bullshit. I cast it. That is not fair. That makes no sense. The wording of the cards is misleading. Dickheads. Um, that seems like a lot of work. I'm just going to hit into there. Healing keeps my board state alive, so I'm just going to do that. Like, so it can't hit back. Okay, so we draw a Sarah, which is a good draw, and I feel like we can play it quite safely at the moment. I want to keep the Vol'jin for Antoninitis. No, we don't need it for Antoninitis, but it's like, it's better for that than a, getting a 6-5 Vol'jin. But I guess 6-5 Vol'jin can... Yeah, that seems kind of kind of good. It's doing the most with the the board we have, which I'm kind of quite happy with. Less less death to silence as well. Like bang bang gets that. I have a six five Vol'jin on board. Ronan, sweet. We can kill Ronan. Good to be able to silence Ronan, but we can kill Ronan. <coughs> it's 
just as kill Ronan. So at this point we play the Azure Drake. The Chimwall has six life, but like Fireball then Arcane 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 is really really strong. So I wanna play the Azure Drake. Just heal up past turn. Like the ch the Chimwall can get more value. Later, I mean, we can like currently we're disfavored. We are fucking disfavored. Why would you? Oh, because they cost zero now. Oh, that is so salty. Okay, that worked out well for him. So now we need to play through at least three fireballs. He might not kill anything though. If that happens, we're okay. If it does kill something, we're fucked. Okay, we're fucked. Okay, um... We can bang into the Antoninitis that doesn't kill anything. I need to play... I might be able to use the... I might be able to use the Sarah. To draw something, but that doesn't get past that. The Chillmore just gets he goes fireball to me, fireball to it. He's still got three fireballs to the face. And just attacks through for one, two, three, four, five. I think we need to at least try and get a Holy Nova. Okay, that's something. So bang you into you, heal you up, get rid of the worm. You die to a ping, but you've got three fireballs. I just want less fireballs going in my face at the moment. Frostbolt onto to the okay so. We've got to be careful of our life total. So here I'm going to play you and heal you up to keep you alive and then I guess we make you a contender for one of the fireballs. Your random spell was brawl? Fuck. Okay. I'm okay with that. Fuck. Oh man, this is so tough. Um. At this point, Chilmore might get out a dragon from his hand, and I can just heal myself up for two, keeping me four out of, like, fireball range. So these three cards are fireballs. Okay, so one fireball is gone. And one card was in a stable portal, which is him a mana crystal. He's always going to do that. Okay, we've got to be careful here. So that takes us down to... Well, I guess here's where we play the... You... You... Heal. Okay, cool. That's a, that's a good mirror entity for us. Heal us up. The game's going uh, 9 cards to our 8 cards, so we're kind of parity with cards. Okay, cool. So we've gotten rid of 2 of the fireballs.
Right, I'm a bit worried.